Good morning, good morning. Out here at the house, checking things out. Uh, wanted to give new home buyers some uh, advice. So I'm out here at the house, looking at the plans. This is how it look here. Um, I like the fact that the whole arch here, all this will be stone. Um, can't really see the texture, but that'll be brick. So brick and stone front and all the rest. And um, it always feels good to see your name on the paperwork. It really does. But I'm noticing that when I go through, the advice that I want to give is go through your plan, everything you select, because all this is a lot. You know, you could easily just get caught up in, ooh, my house, what it's going to be, what you got in mind. Pay attention to your plan. Because, see, in this bathroom, this is going to be my toilet. I put an outlet here because, see, all this, my whole house is going to be a smart home. And I wanted an outlet there because I'm putting my Google, my little Google, what they call it, dot, so I can play music. When I use the bathroom, I like to listen to music. This is a standard outlet. I requested for a uh, outlet to be here. I'll take you to my plan on my iPad. Um, Cause see, I'm gonna go back out to work. So I'm like, hey, let me you know. Let me check, make sure everything's good, all is well. So let me get this right. This is the bathroom that I just took you to. If you notice, that's the outlet that was on the floor. That's the standard one I told you. This is the outlet that I added, and that's not in there. And see, if I wouldn't have came home, my wife would have known none of these things. I do all the paperwork and all the logistics stuff. She just, she's the cosmetic person. There's not an outlet right there. It's just this outlet here. It's just this standard one. And see, they finna put insulation in because eventually they're gonna be drywalling and my outlet wouldn't have been there. I wouldn't have been happy. So I'm glad that I'm here to go through things to uh, see what's going on, you know. Now for the most part, uh, we're looking in, where we at? The uh, family room right here. If you notice, I put two outlets up here where the fireplace is with the TV with the Cat 6. When you go up here, this is what you see. You see the two, one outlet, another outlet, Cat 6 setup. So that's where it needs to be. So when you go through your plan, you go through your selections, make sure everything you chose is there because mistakes do happen. Like when you look at my morning room, my bump out, there's supposed to be a light that drops down here and I put four extra LED lights because I want this area well lit. When you look up here, there's one light, no LEDs, no four LEDs. That's something else they got to be checked out. But see, like I said, I'm glad that I came home because I, if I wouldn't have came home and we would have got to this walkthrough or closing and my stuff wasn't in here, I'd have been pissed. You know, uh, I would have been pissed. Like these outlets I need to check. They put two standard ones. This is the island. Actually, what I'm sitting this iPad on. You zoom in. Outlet there, outlet there. I'm supposed to have two extra ones. Now, I do see the pendant light set up. That's what you see there. One, two, three over the island. Three outlets. So we're gonna check and see that I have um, where my outlet's supposed to be. Let me see this island. It's supposed to be two here, two here. So I'm assuming this is it. You know, there's yellow wires. One, two, and then I'm gonna say three and four. So pretty much you're just doing a checklist of everything that you selected to make sure, you know, everything is how you want it to be. It's like uh, I added two extra uh, outlets up here above my cabinets. You see them up here. Outlet up here, outlet up here, and I put an extra one above the cabinets because I got under cabinet lights, but I want above cabinet lights as well. I did the under cabinet lights with them. I'm gonna do the uh, above cabinet lights on my own. But like I said, you gotta check your plan because a lot of, you know, when he, you know, when he walked through with me, he said, uh, you said everything was good, Mr. Treadwell? Yeah, well, hell, your NASCAR threw this damn thing. All I saw was, this is this, this is that. Over here is this, and hell, that was fast, you know? So we finna go through it real slow today, but we also finna correct what I did not see and what I should see. So for new home buyers, go through your plan slow. Don't allow nobody to go through with you fast because... This is very important. We, we work hard for our money. Not to say somebody trying to, you know, screw us over. It's just they got tons of homes to build. And 
they don't necessarily ha- they don't have the time to babysit us but when you're spending your money you're gonna babysit me because we're gonna do this right you know we're gonna do this right we're gonna get it right today so anyway um a few other things i'm missing the outlet of my basement um so pretty much the builder's on his way now so we can talk about this so matter of fact since i got y'all watching we're gonna go down here to this room and check this out because i added i didn't add too much in here um let's see everything's right in here you got your four led lights where they need to be light in the middle this bathroom is supposed to um let's see it's supposed to have uh i put it come with an outlet and i put another one so that right there is an outlet and it's supposed to be another outlet in here and i don't see it do i huh nope so yeah yeah we're gonna talk about this because something ain't right where's my outlet yeah because it's supposed to be another outlet over here i just see that one right there but i'm supposed to have another one um in this bathroom yeah some things got missed but we're gonna get them straightened out today because uh yeah, yeah I, don't, I, don't, I don't i don't like i don't like that i don't like that at all mm-hmm. yeah we're gonna get this taken care of another thing that i want to share um i did it if you can do it um we end up doing lvp floors throughout the whole first floor uh cost a little more than what i wanted to spend but if you try to go you know if you like i said if you can do it do it if you can't it usually you can't but say you want the floors to be done on all these floors go ahead and do it with the builder because it's going to cost you more later to do outside of the builder unless you know how to do it on your own unless you know somebody i don't know anybody that can do it uh successfully and um i don't like this kind of work i like that i can do all the technology stuff smart home but you know all that other stuff that's not for me so anyway um that's all i got for you this morning just wanted to give you that advice if you are building brand new construction um pay attention to your plan look at everything detail for detail Oh, and this is something that they're doing in the homes that I love. That orange wire that you see, that's the uh, pest control wire where there's a hookup outside. It runs through the whole baseboard of the first floor of the home. And what it does is there's a chemical that disperses within the walls and it keeps people from having to come to your house and spray. So it's all through the walls there. So it's pretty good. So, Like I said, that's all I got for you this morning.